Yo, yo, who's so? Where the hell you been? Called you like three times. We saw you kill a Halloween, haven't seen you since. Are you too good for us now? And we get it. What is up, guys? Good morning, good afternoon, good night, whatever it is for you. Hope you're having a great day today. And welcome back to another vlog. Gonna be really, really quiet right now. It is after six o'clock in the morning. Everybody else in my house is asleep. I am currently getting ready to head out the door at 6.30 to go off and help roast this pig. Trying to get everything packed up right now and ready to go that I might need chargers in case. We got my portable charger, got my extra camera battery, gotta grab some sunglasses, gotta grab an empty water bottle for the day and get some shoes on and everything. Still gotta get the vlog up. Dealing with a whole mess of it. Still wanting to add updates and it not being able to update the computer so it's just been one thing after another but almost completely ready a little bit ahead of schedule which is awesome so i finish getting ready and then we'll be off ready to go think it finally stopped updating or at least trying to and is restarting right now so hopefully everything works out and i can actually use this and get this vlog up before i leave the video did not get up i'm gonna have to do it when i get back later on the computer was still causing problems and still saying it needed to update things so i don't know what else to do i gotta check things out thoroughly i know we've seen a lot of shit whole time we've been together thought we knew it all but just couldn't predict the weather i think about you when the mad's in the house and some kids and wonder if you found another and it's all his see baby girl i know you love me even through the lies because honesty and truth is always found within your eyes sometimes i see you when you love it but you fear it because you try your hardest to run but still feel me in your spirit baby. we finally made it to the destination and this is so beautiful up here on the mountains took forever to find we were like driving on this sketchy back country road and we're just like is this place anywhere in sight and then just happened to so be at the very end of the road but these people have an awesome place they got a lot of land mountains and everything like or hills whatever you want to call them but it looks so beautiful plus all the fall colors right now it's gonna be a good day plus it's absolutely beautiful out here unloading the truck right now we've already actually got the pig on over there in that big pig roaster but trying to get the garbage can out right now, I was originally trying to get it out through this spot right here, but it makes more sense to get it out through the back. Sometimes it gets there, but I don't wanna escape Feels like we're falling nowhere, but I'll do whatever it takes And maybe someday we'll get there we're Gone to, gone to, gone for me to say But I love you for so perfectly Good old porky pig <laughs> I don't know why I just said that. The, all I could think of was Porky Pig. And <laughs> <laughs> My cousin would kill me, right? Yeah. Because <laughs> she adores pigs. Oh. She had a stuffed pig her entire life. She still has it. <laughs> Tell her we have one too. <laughs> Got about another 10 minutes until the pig is completely done. Then we're going to just shut everything off, let it sit for about 15 minutes, and then we can get it all carved up and get it into the tins so that way they can be put out to be served. It looks so good, you guys saw it. I didn't film it at the beginning because it just looked really weird and now I'm just like, you know what, film it anyway. I haven't filmed a lot today so I wanna film a little bit more now. They're not biting right now but my legs are gonna look like they went through a war zone after today because the flies are absolutely horrible out here. It reminds me so much of the youth conference except there it was mosquitoes and I mean there were fireflies but they weren't biting you and here they go. I'm gonna bruise a bone or something because I've been slapping my ankles all day because they're like biting me through the socks. So, ugh, what I would do for bug spray right now. Got everything all packed up back in the van. Gonna go say our goodbyes and then hit the road. We got an hour and a half drive ahead of us. I made a valid change of game. Incomparable, we the same to say. I'm riding for a 
I'm meeting y'all that's riding for the fame Honestly, I'm thanking God for everything that I became I could probably be like you, but I've always been different Only riding music sober, you ride only when you're lifted up I know I'm gifted, but it wasn't given That was in my room way before they ever gave it to Now it's time it's to hit the, the road I was about to film walking out of there And I was like, wait a minute, why does this camera look zoomed in? I always do that, I either hit the rocker switch to zoom in Or I think I did and The camera just looks weird, I don't know Temperatures are definitely a dropping around here. You can already see the condensation forming on the windshield. Made it back home. That was the longest hour and a half of my life. I've actually been home for about a half hour now, just sitting and relaxing, showing my family the photos that I took and some of the video from today. I actually took a lot of good photos. I took some panoramics of the property. Gonna be posting those all over social media, so look out for those. I was trying to figure out how to shoot in macro mode on this camera, but I didn't have enough time to work with all the settings because there was like dragonflies going all over the place and I wanted one to land and I wanted to get a shot of it. I really wish that I had like an awesome camera with a macro lens on it and everything that I could take photos of. Like it would be so perfect. But as you can probably tell by my face, we were in direct sunlight all day obviously, but I don't know if it's as bad on my forehead and everything, but the arms and let me see if I can get a shot of my neck. I don't know if you can see that, but I'm sunburnt, and the minute I go get a shower tonight, I know it's just gonna flare up really big, and then I'm gonna be in a lot of pain from sunburn, so gonna be putting on a lot of aloe over the next couple of days. You clench your fist, she gives you a hug, tell you she loves you, but you've been drinking too much, but you don't quit, instead you rather fuss, then take it to the point to where she can't get up. And it makes you feel sick, it breaks your heart, Finally getting the vlog up. I do apologize for this late upload. This morning I was trying my hardest to get it up before I got out of the house, but as I said, my computer was acting up again, and it just it wanted to do the same thing. I haven't figured out what's going on yet. I've still got to take care of it, but the video ups. But the video is up now, so if you have not seen it yet and you want to, the link is down in the description below. Had a really fun time today. It was just so amazing. A day of first time experiences. Obviously, first time roasting a pig, first time peeling apples, especially with that little contraption. Like, that was actually pretty cool. Like, I was really into it. First time being in a place like that. The property was a thousand acres, plus the mountains or the hills, whatever you wanted to call them, were beautiful with all the fall colors just starting to appear and everything. Like, that was just being able to enjoy nature today. And it was also the first time that I'd gone a whole day without cell phone service since I've had a cell phone. And it was actually quite peaceful not having to look at notifications just put the phone down and not have it be a distraction the only time I really looked at the phone was to check the time so we could keep an eye on foods and know what we were working with and then to take some photos I am a little bummed that I didn't get to film a lot more because I wanted to take so much more video of that property and I also wanted to include a lot more video of the roasting experience but I'm sure it won't be the last time in my life that I ever roast a pig so next time I'll probably try to film as much as I possibly can but it was just nice enjoying nature today. However, I got a really awesome vlog for you guys tomorrow because it is the live team kickoff for 2017. It's going to be really great. I gotta go to work first tomorrow morning because I didn't go today, so I gotta go tomorrow. It's gonna be a pretty tiring day, but it's gonna be also pretty fun. Gotta come home, gotta change into my quote unquote disco outfit. I literally don't have anything disco, so I'm wearing what I would wear if I were to go to a nightclub, which I'm still not old enough to really do, unless I can find a nightclub that allows 18 year olds, but I, I'm gonna go by myself. I'll feel like a loner. Then we're going to mass. I'm carrying a, one of the banners in the banner possession. My sister is altar serving. Then we got to kick off the disco party, gonna get the groove thing on. I can't believe I just said that, but it's gonna be absolutely amazing. I hope you guys are ready. But with that being said, that's pretty much gonna wrap it up for today. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching. I also wanna welcome any brand new viewers that are here right now watching this video. If you enjoyed it and you so desire to, please slap a like on this video. Don't forget to turn those post notifications on down below so that way you never miss when I upload a brand new video to this channel also if you haven't yet but I don't understand why you haven't yet subscribe down below by hitting that big red subscribe button and I will see you guys tomorrow with another brand new daily vlog remember to stay awesome keep smiling you're beautiful and I love you guys so much peace out YouTube I think I'm
Falling for my side Falling for my side Falling for my side Falling for my side Now I really wanna kick it I get it